Brazil is one of the top pesticide consuming countries in the world, using over 370,000 tons of pesticides per year. Pesticides can make their way into the soil, the food that we consume, and into our bodies, possibly causing health risks. But a group of local farmers want to change that culture through agroecology. A agroecologia era algo cultural. Como eu me relaciono com as demais pessoas da sociedade e como eu me relaciono com o ambiente, com a natureza. In this settlement in southern Brazil, over 150 families work with agroecology, a sustainable approach to agriculture that uses no pesticide. They seek to increase biodiversity and reduce ecological impact as much as possible. One of the principal ideas of agroecology is the diversification of crops. Fruits and vegetables are often planted together to guarantee biodiversity. The farmers also use dead plants and fallen fruit as organic fertilizers. They are also responsible for conserving many types of Creole seeds, which are traditional varieties of seeds that have been cultivated locally for generations. Some of the locals have adopted agroforestry in their fields. Agroforestry incorporates the cultivation of crops with the cultivation and conservation of trees. A agrofloresta, ela ajuda na base aí de produzir a questão de carbono, mas também produz alimento, né? Até fruta para os passarinhos, para as abelhas, a flor, tudo isso. Então a agrofloresta, ela ajuda ajuda a filtrar toda essa poluição que está aí. Porque a natureza descoberta sem vegetação verde, você olha ali é um negócio morto. Então a agrofloresta é vida. But they don't just want to keep these practices in the settlement. They want others to learn as well. E dentro do assentamento também tem a escola latino-americana de agroecologia, que ela iniciou em 2005. Knowledge is greatly valued and students from all over the world come here to learn agroecology in theory and in practice. The school is endorsed by the Federal Institute of Paraná that assists in supplying them with professors and diplomas. Assentamento do Contestado complies with many of the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals for the 2030 Agenda. They seek to grow organic food in a sustainable manner, combat climate change, and grant quality education for future generations. For these residents, agroecology is not just agriculture, it is their culture.